Good afternoon, everybody. So what we're going to do today is show you how to put a whoopee sling onto a tree. What we're going to demonstrate today is with a porter wrap at the base of the tree. All a whoopee sling is, is essentially an adjustable dead eye sling. It's got a berry here where you can lengthen or shorten the sling as you need to. So the first thing that we do is we'll girth hitch the closed eye onto our porter wrap and it always goes on the straight bar. What we've done there, we've created a choke. Now the porter wrap's ready to put onto the tree. This is a fair size fur here, so I've had to max out the whoopee sling to get it to go around. So all I'm gonna do is throw the adjustable bite around the trunk. So it's important that your eye's big enough on all of your slings that when you choke it, you're choking on the eye. Alright, so now we've got the whoopee sling with the porter wrap on it set up onto the tree properly. One thing to keep in mind is when you've got a choke around, you know, a spar or an object, you can really only go in three directions. So we're good to pull that way, upward pull we're good, and pulling downward we're good. But if you were putting your load on this way, you can see how the whoopee sling pulls around the trunk. We don't want that. And that's going to happen regardless of the type of hitch you tie. The timber hitch is going to do the same thing. They're directional, as is a cow hitch. 